if you're organizing an event and you do not want to show the, the you want to keep the names or the list or the emails of recipients you want to keep it private without showing it when you send emails for the event or an update kind of email or whatever type of situation if you want to keep the recipient email secret and not let other people have access to the email list then i'm going to show you how you can send this type of email i'm going to be sending this email from my work email so as to show you because mostly from if you are working you are going to be having an outlook account so with the outlook account you want to select and create a new email and in the email you want to make sure that you go to the section that says option if you select the option you're going to be activating this bcc which is the broadcast uh, message you can see that these specified people will receive the message secretly. So if you activate that, then this option will come up and then you can start adding the emails of the people you want to send the email to. So I will send that email to myself and to my, my, to my personal email account. So now I have two recipients and I'm going to oh, type something like this is a, this is a test email. In some instances, it's even better to just send the email to yourself so that you as the recipient receive the email rather than it's just showing blank like the way when I showed you earlier here, the way it was showing blank. It was not showing who the email was meant for. So I'm going to send that email to myself and then to these two other people and I will then click the subject of this email will be test testing two. And then I click the send. If I open my personal email and go to the inbox, I'll delete this first that I received. You can see, uh, if I test there, check the email, you can see here that we have the testing tool. And if we check who the email is meant for, I've sent that email from my work email to myself, and it's not showing the email address of this recipient, which is what you want to do. So that's how to create an email whereby you keep the recipient's uh, email secretive for data protection policy if you don't want other people to have access to the email of the participants that will be attending your events. The other option that you can do is to create the same email, but instead of sending it to yourself, you only send it directly to people so if you use the regular method this one everybody will receive the email and then they can see the other people that you've included in the email but with the bbc with the bcc it's a secretive method so nobody will get your nobody will get the email if you don't want them to have an access to it so if you click send i'm going to send it anyway if you click send then the imp the inbox of the person will not display who the email so who is supposed to receive the the recipient of the email is what I meant. So the, yes, so the new email has arrived, and you can see that it's it's vacant. So that's how to do the sending of the email. If you find this video useful, please click the subscribe button or the like button if you don't want to subscribe. Thank you, and see you in my next video. Goodbye.